Hello chess champions, we're back and today we're doing yoga with my lovely daughter Catherine. Enjoy. Hi friends, um, to get started we're gonna just start in your little crisscross and if you want to put your hands like this, look like Buddha, you can. Um, and yoga is really good for strength, flexibility and to help you with your posture. So start here, take a few deep breaths in and release. Make sure to fully relax. If you want to shake it out a little bit, you can. Um, and from here, we're going to go do go into extended child's pose. So what that is, is you're going to open your legs a little bit, lean forward, and stretch back like this. Don't forget to breathe. And then from here, you're going to get into a tabletop like this, and you're going to do the it's called a cat cow. And to be a cat, it kind of looks like a scared cat on Halloween. You're gonna arch your back up like this and put your head down. And it's supposed to stretch out your back. And you're gonna do the same thing for a cow, except you're gonna arch down like this and stick your head up. Good. And now we're gonna do something called the dizzy cow, okay? And what that is, is you're gonna go in like a counterclockwise motion, like this. And you're going to stretch it out. And you can lean back into extended child's pose and stay here for a second. Come up, keep circling, just stretch it out, get that body moving. And stop up top and go around the other way. One more circle. Stay in extended child's pose for a second. And come back. Now from here, get to tabletop again where your hands are underneath your shoulders and your knees are shoulder width apart. And um, we're gonna plank. You know what that is? Okay, I'll scoot back so you can see me a little better. What you're gonna do, it's kinda like right before you go into a push-up, you're gonna get right here and you're just gonna hold it. Can we try and hold it for 10 seconds? Ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. Put yourself down easy. And from here, actually, we're going to go into baby cobra. So slowly release. See so right here, baby cobra, and push yourself all the way up to upward facing dog. You should feel a nice little stretch in your lower back. And from here, you're just going to move gently and do upward facing dog. No, downward facing dog. We're at upward facing dog. Downward facing dog, so push back and up and try and push your feet, your ankles into the ground and keep breathing. And then from here, you're going to hop it up from your feet and try and get your feet in between your hands. Ready? One, two, three, hop it up. Good. And now we're going to do tree pose. So, cameraman, I'm going to need your help. You're gonna come up and tree pose you can do three different ways. You can keep your feet, you can keep your one foot down by your ankle like that. You can bring it up a little bit more or if you wanna bring it all the way up here, you can. So you can keep your hands here or you can shoot them up right up there and hold it. Deep breath in and one more. Oh, keep your balance. Down. Good. Be gentle with yourself. Come back down. And from here, we're going to go back to tabletop. Help me out. Come in. And what we're going to do from here is go back to plank. Okay. And shoot your right leg up. Okay. Put the other knee down. Come up like this. And this is called the warrior pose. And you follow along. It's called the warrior pose. Because we're all warriors. And bring it up. Shoot your arms straight over your head. And for the first one, since your right leg is out, we're going to turn and face this way. If you want to, you can show me your muscles. Because mm, we're all warriors, right? Good. Deep breath. Okay, come back up, face forward, and bring it down. Good. Now, so 
into right leg back. And now we're going to send our left leg up. Ready? Drop our right leg. Do the same thing. Up. Good. Help me out. <laughs> and then, since our left leg is out, we need to turn this way. Show your muscles again. Good. Deep breath. Face the front and bring it back down. Good. Send it back. Good job. Now, come back to tabletop. And for this, just cross your right leg over your left and come on through. Okay. And now I'm going to face you so you can see me. And from here, we're just going to do a butterfly stretch. Take a deep breath. And put your toes together. If you want to flap your wings, totally can. But just stretch it out. Take a deep breath. Let it out. Feeling great. And then from here, stretch out your legs, wiggle your toes, arms up, and over. And just hold it for a second. Feel the stretch behind your calves. Gastrocnemus. And your, yep, what is it? And gastrocnemus. Gastrocnemus. And your hamstrings. And your hamstrings. And stretch it out. You should feel it. And you can even feel it a little bit in your back. And just let your head drop and feel the relief. And now from here, I'll turn this way again. I'll scoot so you can see me. And here we're gonna go to the lazy lizard, which all it is is you're just gonna lay back, put your arms up, and breathe, and just be lazy. Ready? Be gentle. Go back nice and soft. Arms up and breathe. Good job, boys and girls. You did it. For those of you who it's first time doing yoga, did great. And for those of you who have experienced it before, awesome. Keep it up. Um, hope to see you next week.